Alright, what is up? It is time to play some more Red Dead. Oh, here we are. Chilling outside the cabin. Alright, gotta go talk to P. Jump over that thing. P is... Shit, not even in here. Okay. <coughs> what up, P? We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. Turn on my For fan. What? Hold 10, on. 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found Enough nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Oh my god, these headphones are on backwards. That's why Hold they're so on. uncomfortable. Here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. All right, Charles. <coughs> Let's go hunting. I'm like caribou or something, yeah. maybe. I don't know. You take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. All right, let's head out. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yet another exciting How walking you montage. Up, Charles, I'm okay. Apart from this hand, stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. So, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. Okay. Whew. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater. Getting what stuck really in the storm, happened on that boat? Bringing John back in. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. <laughs> Me neither. The fucking well, boat, dude. told me a bit, but it sure oh. weren't good. There we go. gameplay real fun real good there's some patches of grass here this is good let's look down that this shit? way okay the winds died down too that's good. 
No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now, shh. Stay quiet. Hey, stop here a second. I see something. Where? Oh, uh, shit. Careful. Just, what, am I hitching him to the fucking ground? All right. There's deer been here. And recently. How can you tell? Maybe it's the tracks. We'll track them on foot. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. All right. Here I go. You see the tracks? Uh, I see think em. so. Maybe not. Focus. That focus on track. <laughs> Honestly, that's not much more helpful. Snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in like grass and woods. White on white. Tracking? Where the fuck did it go? Oh. It's a shit. Oh, wait, there it is. See it. I see it. You're sent. Look. There they are. Are you ready with that bow? Try to hit him in the neck or head. Quick and clean. Okay. You can pull back quite hard. You'll feel when it's too much. Good shot. Ooh, got him. Now let's try for another. Ooh, got him. Oh, it's another one right, ac right across the creek, right there. Look at him. Can I use a gun now? Because, like... I think we already got one, it should be enough. Oh, go ahead, take your time. Fucking... Yep. Slow as shit. There we go. Got my arrow. Alright, fucker. <laughs> I'm gonna get fuck I'm gonna get trench foot. I get this one? Oh no, here we go, here we go. Yeah. Uh, what? Unlucky. Take your time. Bullshit, that was right in the fucking head. That was right in the head, dude. The dot was red. You saw it, I saw it. Everybody at the RB saw it. Oh, there they went. All right, bud. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. We got it. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay. You pick up one. I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Ooh. Oh, it's cold. Oh, oh god, just <laughs> waist deep is fucking balls are shrunk. And no balls left. Alright, come here. Oh, yep, yep, just uh, jump over the deer, that's what I wanted. Where's my horse? Slow as shit. Oh, 
Ready to head back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. You gonna make us run all the way back without a cutscene, or could we just... We just cutscene it up, you know? Nice work, Arthur. Should be Thanks. enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Yeah, it's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. Mm -hmm. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm -hmm. You're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big Shit. price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. All right. And we know how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater. We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good though we caught more than one. A lot of mouths to feed. And that girl from the ranch now, too. But not sure she'll be eating much. She has a wild look in her eye. You would, too. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. Huh. So what do we do with her? Once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. So it was O'Driscoll's you ran into there? Yeah. <laughs> Last thing we was expecting. What is it with the O'Driscoll's? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six huh? months. I guess because I'm they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big game. Nasty Bless you. sons of bitches. Bless you. Their leader, Combe, and Dutch go way back. Bless you. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Dude, like most of this game is ooh a bear. Most of this game is just fucking walking next to someone Watch and up. listening to them talk. Bear up ahead. Let's see That's if we can find another way around. It's got electrolytes. I need electrolytes for my. You must be real hungry. Stay well back. I don't want to take my fucking like deer. The worst for animals that sleep all winter. Come on, Charles. Where's the other half? You know what, those don't really do anything for me. That's why I just eat the happy ones. The happy ones are the only ones that make me feel. You know? Cut up here. Off the trail. Can you pass it to me? No, I've had the calm and I've had the relaxed one. But I don't know. Just, what the hell? Oh, God. Calm down. Whoa, boy. Calm down, horse. I have not tried a hole. I'll try a hole. Sure. Yeah, that's not really do much. much you, hey. How long you been with us now? Five, this is a Gibbles months? McGee first. I'm eating an Something edible. Something like that? But you didn't expect this? What? Any of this? Blackwater mess? Tastes like... Being up here? Tastes like hippie armpit. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. Oh, not at all. I just I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still <laughs> wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, Hello. we need you now. More than ever. Good. You're almost back yet? How Jesus, long have you been fuck. With these boys? 
Why ain't you run off? Me? Huh? Twenty years, something like that. Since I was a boy. Twenty years? Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things. Him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. Bless it. I appreciate Why you so much? Take time the other night. She's a strong one. Oh shit, I forgot. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster oh, than fuck, we're here. Okay, finally. Take Jesus Murphy. Time over here. Brought some food back, boys. <sighs> Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow proper. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Eat it. What a surprise. Find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. They're drinking Let rum in the game. Days. You know what that you makes me want? Me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, you get right. dumped on the floor there. Ooh. Yep. That's, yep, it's all fleshy. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck. Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting, after all these years. <coughs> yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> oh. Oh, got auto save. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's go talk to B. Because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> <A> party. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching. Hard! 
You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? <laughs> All of you, we got work to do. Come on. You gonna go punch people you now? Sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Colm O'Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah! I like his voice. He sounds like a SpongeBob character. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. The cab near some more riding horses. Okay. <laughs> in the fucking stuff. God the damn it! God damn it, Amber! That's all this game is. It's riding horses in the snow. Yeah, this, I'm playing story mode. Oh, maybe I haven't done the story yet, though. But it's like it's like GTA Online. You like make a cowboy. I wonder if it's still popular. I don't know. What's that? Tracks. Horses. Quite a few of them. As far as I can tell. The only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this snow. is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him. Yeah, I had to put him out there because he's die. fucking with the lights back there. This feud between oh, you and he'll him put his face in him and look directly at the light. Rest, one way or another. Oh. It will be. Some it's things like... I can forgive, others I can't forget. <laughs> Walt Tits? What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Whoa there. Hold up here. All right, gentlemen. This is it. in the way. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. I going? Oh, do I gotta get off? Alright. Alright. It's like in Lord of the Rings, you know, when they're climbing up the side of the mountain. <clears throat> and Saruman's across, chanting fucking spells to make the mountain fall. Good stuff, good stuff. There they are. That's definitely them. Why oh, do they got more people than I us? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Well, what does he look like? Is that horse pink?
Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Oh my god, I slapped him. Oh no. You leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down there. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. Okay. You two, get up there and keep us covered. You got it, Dutch. Good. Come on, let's go. It'd be cooler if I used the, the bow. Path down is Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah. Just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including coal, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. Can't just snipe them from up here. Well, we just gotta walk slow as shit. Oh. oh, watch out. It's a bit steep. It'd be funny if I just fell, rolled down the mountain. Then the O'Driscoll saw me and we started fighting, but I'm already dead. Bottom of the mountain. I fell. Mm. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No. But the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Down through these trees, quick. They get down here so fast. Okay, let's get in cover. <laughs> that feller smacked you up something. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Oh, fuck, missed. Oh, there it is. Boys, kill these sons of bitches. Kill every last one of these bastards. Where are they at? Here? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Way up there. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Day. 
bodies. Strip everything we can from them. Do you okay. recognize any of them, Dutch? Of course not. Cole doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun, ride a horse, and kill without thought, you're in. Think how long some of you have been with me. <laughs> I imagine Cole doesn't Damn, that guy had 79 cents on him. He's rich. Oh, shit! Look out! He had like a tin of Dapper Dan. Dead? The cowards are running away. Good work, boys. Back to the camp. We'll get what we need. Clear yeah. out. The hiccups. We're waiting on you, Arthur. Come right here, shut up. Okay. Let's wait for Javier and Lenny. They're coming down with the horses. Keep an eye out for any more of the bastards. Nice of you two to join us. Is everyone all right? I think so. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. <clears throat> Bill, you go search that wagon there. Horse looks Mike, fucked. Search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. Okay. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. All right, crackers. Backy? Fuck yeah, dude. What's in here? Money. What we got here? Right. Hey, this looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Want some dynamite? Did we get everything? Dynamite. Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. You wanna go with me to the gas station? Get rum. This is something about the train they was gonna okay. run. A Mr. Leviticus. What happened to one of the lights? Mount back up. Let's God damn moving. it. All right, let's get out of here. Oh no. You boys, all of you. Not a man that, down. Man. Good work, fellers. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like, but we will always get back up and fight. That's yeah, they can pound are. us hard, but we're we're Outlaws good. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Yeah. Please, please, don't let me have to run all the way back. Just be a cutscene. Come on, give me a solid. Oh, 
out. It's not looking good. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Colm? Leave him to me. Oh, God. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Ah. All right, I'm coming. Go, go. Lasso. Here we go. Dollar and some horse medicine on him. I'm no use to you, really. <laughs> What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! It was pissing. What happened when I killed him? When I just failed the mission? Please, mister! You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. Come on, just name your price. Oh, I think I'm gonna puke. Please, I'll do anything! Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. Bless you. Oh, fuck. I'm back. Okay. Good. Introduce you to the boys. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp. No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Few days later. It's been a bad few weeks, but <laughs> Dutch, being Dutch, he is busy making plans and 
Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Who the hell is Leviticus I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You're still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. Want me to come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marcy. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill! Now, you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to oh, lie low and head back out west. Now, what did they do? Suddenly, we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? Yeah, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob! All right! We're moving out! Follow me! Okay, gentlemen, listen up. All of you, according to the information so kindly provided to us by the Odrisco, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep a lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer that run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars to deal with any guards. Arthur and Mike. You head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Mr. Cornwall's hey, private parts. You got a problem got with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep, Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now, come on! Let's rock! Kid. Of course I'm ready. 
Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times are you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back. And that's the end of it. Money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, then we stack railroad bonds on this train. Hey! Oh, shit. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now, everyone, shut up! Get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. There's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Or just take okay. a shit? Oh. Whoa. How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Good. All right. Blow it up now. That should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. Says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be mm. here any minute now. Why are they worried about covering their faces? It's not like they got cameras back then. You know? Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck. All of you, you all know what to do.
up the wire, but we won't mention that. What is wrong with you boys? Oh. Come on. Some fellas hold up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good Here enough. Go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. Am I going to look cool? All right. All right come on. Just walk on out. We don't want to kill you. My we just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> no way. Oh my god, fuck. Why is everyone running into me? Look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> mm. You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. Nice fine I'll brandy. Okay, let's see if we can get this open. Nothing. Uh, 
Get in there. No, this looks like something. I think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Wow. Come on. <clears throat> <sighs> What did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride! Yeah. Uh... Okay, get on the train, quick, hold it! Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So all right, ready. I'll let him live just because I'm a good guy. Come on, move! Oh, okay. I don't feel like looting all these bodies. It's too many. It's too much. It'll take like an hour. Save. Oh, for Lord's sake, put that book away and go hell. I'm just gonna save it here. Oh, I can't. Never mind. All right, I guess we're watching this. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. Mm. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Can I save you? Nope, that ain't it. Nope, that ain't it. Nope. The shitty ass snow level. That's good. That's good. I was tired of that. I like when they meow and it sounds like they're asking a question. Lenny! Micah! Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. The boy? You can buy me a whiskey. We are saving because I, I what? 
Hold on. Uh, what can I say? What can I say? Come on, we're falling behind. Me now. Shit. Trying. Gotta keep us moving, but calm. Ah, shit. Okay, let's take a look. Oh no. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. I don't know how easy it was back then, huh? Nearly there. There. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well... Get in. I'll tell you. Tell me about when I can save this fucking game. How about that? Fuck you, dude. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river oh. and cut left inland. So. In. It's in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. The they lost it all. Thing. Stolen clean away from them it was. Every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the my middle wagon of off a cliff. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never All forget. Right. This here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Problem. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Hot? Took her somewhere. Too hot. We never saw her. I gotta again. take off my coat or something. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Are we still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. 
No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. The Driscolls? Okay. Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. Just the way it is. Always has been. Here we go. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been oh, in this shit. line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... There we go. I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. These horses got fucking leg warmers on. How do I switch cameras? I forgot. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Ooh, herbs. Alright. Yeah. Let's just park this fucking hoe so I can save the goddamn game. American Jeans. Oh shit, wrong way. What's going off road. Head in there, follow the track for a bit. Okay. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Okay, bud. Come on. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. All right. You were wrong, Jose. This place Here is perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were on to something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just these worried. Guys really just don't I trust ain't got each that other. long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money, and a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen. I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, yeah, see if I can skeleton. strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off 
when they shut down our factory to the north. Fuck. Now get out there and see I what you can top hat find. Right there. So, what Uncle, I look good in a top hat? Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. Okay. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. Hell yeah, dude. Weeks later, got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more. And I always have that beard. I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. Spot of black water in that whole mess. Right there. Fucker. Jose. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> All right. And now we can save. Uh, that place is uh, as good as any to stop. So, uh... It's been real. Watch my other videos, too.